In this video, let's see the rules regarding symmetricity. If you find that you have a given equation of a curve and upon drawing the diagram of the curve you come to know that the curve is either symmetrical above or towards the x-axis or towards the y-axis, you have a benefit that the question has become now simpler. How? Because see, this first diagram as you can see, whatever part is above the axis, that same part is below the axis. If I am supposed to find this whole shaded area, I can easily know that whatever area would be above the x-axis would be same below the x-axis. So what I will do is, I will find any one area. Say suppose I find only this area which is above the x-axis and multiply by 2. That will give me the complete area. So you don't have to find the area first of the top portion then of the bottom one. Directly find to 1 and multiply by 2. The same approach goes here. The same approach goes here in the sense that here as you can see whatever part is to the left of y-axis is to the right of y-axis as well. Again this can be termed as symmetricity and that is why I would be like to say that here if you find only one area, suppose you find this area only, then you can easily say that multiply by 2 will give me the whole area. So that gives me a simpler reason to calculate if symmetricity is there only that will work otherwise this won't work. 